Today, I can tell you that Vera Rubin is in full production. NVIDIA CEO Jensen Huang said Monday that the company's next generation of chips was in full production, promising to deliver five times the AI computing of earlier models. He was speaking at the annual Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas. It comes as the world's most valuable company faces mounting competition from rivals and its own customers. Set to launch later this year, the flagship Vera Rubin platform packs six separate NVIDIA chips with 72 graphic units and 36 new central processors. These can be linked into pods with over a thousand Rubin chips working together. To achieve these performance gains, Huang said the hardware uses proprietary data formats that he hopes the industry will embrace. This is completely revolutionary. This is how we were able to deliver such a gigantic step up in performance, even though we only have 1.6 times the number of transistors. The AI chip leader also introduced new features aimed at helping chatbots handle complex conversations with millions of users simultaneously. Huang also showcased new self-driving car software called Alpamayo that he said will be open sourced. Not only do we open source the models, we also open source the data that we use to train those models. Because that in that way, only in that way, can you truly trust how the models came to be. The same day saw rival AMD show off its latest AI chips in Las Vegas too. It's selling them to customers, including ChatGBT maker OpenAI.